The title Be Inspired is originally a hashtag that I've been using on social media when posting inspiring quotes. With this record, I am here to inspire and encourage other women to fully direct and run their music projects. I directed the entire album from start to finish. I wrote, composed, I arranged the songs, I recorded and performed the vocals, piano and synths, and I directed the musicians, the mixing and mastering engineers. The songs will make your dreams feel all kinds of emotions and they will take you on a journey. Since I didn't have to follow my vision through a middleman, I was able to express my entire creativity and it's come out phenomenal. Some people say, oh, we need more women musicians, producers, and songwriters. When they are there, they're just intimidated or not given the right opportunities or guidance. I have come across that idea many times over the years that to make a good album or to get some credibility, you have to hide yourself behind the name of a well-known male producer. I have made quite a few and to me it's always come down to why would I work so hard making them understand what my music and vision are about when in the end they never really see it as clearly as I do. So I want to say to all the women songwriters and musicians all over the world, if you have a vision, you can do it too. Yes, it takes a lot of work, you have to learn a lot of different skills and you will have to make sure that you do not believe anyone that tells you that you cannot do it. Be firm and a great communicator when working with your team and making requests. When you work with the right people, you will get the respect that you deserve. Feel Good is an upbeat morning song that will help you start the day in a good mood. I came up with an optimistic piano rhythm with simple syncopation to drive the band and the song. Ryan Schubel, who is the mix engineer on the album, really helped bring out even more energy to the song. After Dark is a very emotional song. It talks about finding the light after difficult times, whatever they may be. The whole arrangement from the song, from the drums, piano, all the way to the vocals, was about keeping that dynamic progression. So of course for this, I had to pick my favorite string instrument, which is the cello, and I chose to have Jan Mark add this feel to the song. Time to Believe is this high energy song and it's there to wake you up when you're feeling down or losing your hope. Jeff Martin from The Frequency Factory in Ohio, he is the drummer on the album and he gave a really great punch to the song. Ben Bruce, a guitarist in Nashville, also was great to play on the song because he knows really well how to do the chimey guitar tone. Getaway is a romantic escapade. It's about leaving everything to go find nature and traveling and having fun. I wrote it on the ukulele and Juan Pablo Ordonez gave some really great rhythm to the song. We played the percussions together. I recorded the tambourine and the hand claps and he added all the other stuff. And here's the first drum. I composed Summer Rain and along with the bridge solo on the piano and then I transposed everything for ukulele. I had Juan Pablo Ordonez play on this song too and he gave this freshness that we get from the rain in the hot summer. Rise Above has a very big message of unity, compassion and understanding. It is the biggest arrangement on the album with 46 tracks. Around the piano, I wanted to have like a low beat with a lot of different tones and strings and guitars. I structured and arranged uh, some vocal harmonies 
And I think the big cherry on the cake was having 21 backup vocals and gospel choir performed by Rick Savage in Nashville. And it really gave that feel of having many people that come together for the same love. I've been performing a piano cover of Come As You Are by Nirvana for several years now. Originally, when I decided to play it, I did not think that I would record it. But I would have such a positive reaction from people that I decided to include it on this album. As an interlude, I thought having an a cappella cover of Chartres et la Mer would be great because it is a really nice transition into the French portion of the album. Also, I have been doing a cappella videos um, with four of me on YouTube and my fans really like that. Writing the same songs in two different languages was definitely challenging because English and French have different tones and syntax. And it's about keeping the same meaning and still having beautiful rhythms and rhymes. Si bien and Prédité have the same story in both languages. Petunia's song is different because I actually wrote it first and then I heard that the music had a vacation theme so I wrote Getaway to it. I am very attached to the Mediterranean Sea and I have always been inspired by the ocean. So somehow I wanted it to be in the cover art. I really like the concept of a double exposure photography. So I contacted Christy from Eyestalker and he came up with something really beautiful by blending a portrait of me and a landscape photo of my hometown Toulon in France. 